Hi, today we're going to talk about the differences in the exteriors between the 2019 Acura RDX and the 2017 Acura RDX that I used to have. Overall the exterior has been redesigned and the car is a little bit larger. If you look at the specs, I'm not going to go over all the differences in the exteriors and the styling and so forth, but just go over some of the features of the exterior that are different than my 2017. We'll start with the wheels. I mentioned in my previous video, I do not like these wheels. I think they're too plain. They don't really go with the car. I will be getting aftermarket wheels at some point, most likely black ones. Speaking of the wheels, they are now 19 inch, whereas they were 18 inch on the previous, on the 2017 RDX. The fog lights on the 2019 are LED, where on the 2017 they were not. And uh, I really like the LED lights. I didn't like on the 2017 how the fog lights were not LEDs and they were yellowish circles. So when you had the lights on, the front of the car really didn't look that great because you had the nice LED headlights, but then you had the regular yellowish looking fog lights. The keyless entry is now on the rear doors as well. So you can unlock the car. You hear the beeps that it unlocked using the rear door as well as the front door. On the 2017, it was only on the front door. Also, you don't have the button uh, that used to be around here on the front door to lock the car. When you're outside the car, it uses more of a hidden type button with those three grooves on the top of the handle. One other change with the locking, which I don't think I had this on the 2017. If I did, I didn't know it was available, but I don't think I had it, is that you can do proximity locking. So when you get out of the car and you should hear a beep that'll tell you that's ready and now as i walk away you should hear another beep and you can hear the door lock that i got so far away i think it's five six feet or so that the door locks automatically so you don't have to lock it it'll lock knowing that you have it set that way and that you stepped away from it and the key is so far away from the car itself the fuel door is no longer controlled by a switch on the inside of the car now as long as the doors are unlocked you just push to open and there also is no caps uh, capless so you put the nozzle right in you can now open the rear lift gate using your foot underneath the bumper what you do need to do is you need to do a kicking motion under the bumper and not a swiping motion so if you do a kick motion back and forward you see the door will open on the rear camera there is now a little washer to clean the rear camera on the advanced model. Well, that sums up the uh, significant differences of the 2019 Acura RDX Advanced version that I have found that differ from the 2017 version that I had previously had. I would say all these changes are for the better, except for the wheels. The other changes I either prefer or I'm indifferent to and I'm okay with, but the wheels I do not like as I mentioned in the past. But everything else I think is a good improvement for the uh, RDX uh, advanced version.